Well, we've seen the problems, the lockdowns, and the fear caused by coronavirus. But what is it actually like to be infected with the virus? Patients and survivors have spoken of their experiences. The COVID-19 virus is part of the coronavirus family, like the ordinary seasonal flu. Symptoms include cough, fever, and shortness of breath. Severe cases can result in more dangerous symptoms, like pneumonia, stroke, and kidney failure. But these are only likely to be seen in senior citizens. But I'm a young person, and I'm healthy. So the symptoms I'm having are like a normal cold, like a flu. I had a little bit of fever, headache, general discomfort, but anyone would have thought it was just a cold. As of 3rd March, the World Health Organization estimates the virus has a mortality rate of just 3.4%. This is far lower than the 2003 SARS virus, also a member of the coronavirus group, which had a mortality rate of 10%. Many patients say the most grueling part of being infected is the isolation. I will stay in my house for about 14 days and in these 14 days the health authorities will monitor my situation. I live in a separate room in my home and I use a separate bathroom. My wife and my son live in the other part of the house but they are subject to the so-called quarantine too. Luckily, they are fine. They don't have any kind of symptoms. The novel coronavirus has now been detected on five continents. The situation is already under control in the outbreak's epicenter, China's Wuhan city. So far, 100,000 people have been infected by the virus worldwide, out of which 4,000 have died.